I just wanted to pivot the conversation, if we could, for a moment. You've done remarkable work in, in this space, but I also want to talk to you about the markets, uh, given uh, your, your, your long career on Wall Street and what you think is happening right now. I don't know if you noticed, but literally, while the program's been on, uh, the 10 years now over 1.5, the, the, we're starting to see tech stocks really sell off. Um, and we've been talking about Bitcoin and, and lots of asset bubbles. What do you think is happening? How are you, how are you, uh, how are you thinking about the, the economy right now? I, th I think the economy is beginning to improve. I think uh, we still have a long way to go, but I, I think this new uh, fiscal stimulus will be really very important. And I hope, uh, hope it passes soon. I think as you look at interest rates for the 10 year to be at one and a half, people are really losing money investing for 10 years at less than what the rate of inflation is. So I think, I think that the interest rates have been low for longer than they should have been. And it's just had making a catch up. But I think that rates uh, at these levels and somewhat higher are not too high to take away the, uh, the importance of the equity markets and the ability for them to continue to do well. I think we're seeing on the, on the real extremes uh, lots of uh, activity uh, that really uh, appears not to make much sense. I think it's terrific that younger people are getting interested in investing for their future. And I just hope that the companies that uh, really working with younger people spend more to educate them so that they understand that really good investing is really long-term investing and understanding what you're doing and understanding the companies that you invest your money in. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.